Tommy, how much are you looking forward to Saturday night and leading the Kiwis out one last time? Yeah, yeah, I am actually. Um, yeah, it was a great gesture from the from my manager and the boys to, to ask me to do it. Um, yeah, I, I couldn't really turn it down, could I? And, you know, the chance to um, play my last professional game in, in this jumper, um, you know, it's a real privilege. Looking at your record here at Headingley, you've got a pretty enviable one. 25 games played here in your career, 15 wins and a draw. So right? you're, you're well up on the on the ledger on that one. Yes, I didn't know that. Um, yeah, look, I love playing here. I love playing here. So, you know, the new stadium is fantastic, but I, I really got a soft spot for the old stadium too, mate. Um, some great memories. So, um, you know, the fans here are terrific. And um, obviously with my cousin playing here, Kylie, you know, so, um, a, you know, a club that's really close to our family. So, um, yeah, a great club. And for, for New Zealand, a uh, great chance to, to begin their preparations for the World Cup? Yeah, yeah, for them it's about, I suppose, getting the boys that haven't played for a while a bit of a run out. Um, they've got a, a great squad there, um, a really tight-knit group. Um, yeah, it's, it's just a pleasure to be back, in, back involved and, and catch up with a few old faces and, and being there. Uh, you know, I've had a, a lot of great memories, um, you know, playing for the Kiwis and, and, and being around the group. So, you know, this one's another one. And having won a World Cup with New Zealand, as this squad, what it takes to to lift another World Cup trophy? Yeah, definitely. I think they've got what it takes. Uh, you know, I think back in 2008, I don't even think we knew we had what it took. You know, I think if you think back that far, um, no one picked us to win it. So, you know, it come down to how tight they can get and how close the bond they can get. And, you know, um, they definitely got the talent. You've obviously made your home here in Super League and, yeah. and what you've done with London and Wigan. Uh, great for, for, for some kids down here, say for kids to get to see these stars, the NRL, playing for playing for New Zealand here on their own doorstep? Yeah, yeah, I hope, I hope everyone gets down and has a watch, man. You've got some fantastic players in the squad that, you know, you, know, you don't really get the chance to watch them week in, week out. So um, hopefully they get down and support them and, and come have a look. There's some fantastic players. Um, you know, some of NRL's best players, you know, in the group right there. So um, we're very lucky. And you've come here many times as an opponent, but Leeds fans are very knowledgeable about their rugby league. I'm sure you'll get a, a great reception from them. Will that seem a bit strange? Yeah, maybe a little bit. I've copped a fair bit over the while, but... Um, I've always had respect for the club and, and the supporters. It's a rugby league place, and like I say, with my cousin Kylie, been here for so long. Um, yeah, to respect, respect the place, respect the club. You know, they've got a great history. They've been very successful, and um, yeah, there's nothing but respect. Uh, however way the response goes, I'm not going to take it to heart, mate. It's um, yeah, it's a, it's a great place.